Today's topic is Hashimoto's disease. What is Hashimoto's disease associated with the thyroid gland? Is it a serious disease? And how is it treated? The most important information and details are in this video. Hashimoto's disease is an autoimmune disease that may affect the thyroid gland in the body, and the thyroid gland is a gland that's responsible for producing hormones that regulate many processes in the body, such as heartbeat, metabolism, and many others. When infected with this disease, the immune system begins to produce antibodies that attack the thyroid gland, which may cause damage to this gland over time, which results in many complications. Hashimoto's disease causes. There is no clear and specific cause of Hashimoto's disease. It is an autoimmune disease in which the immune system begins to attack the body itself. But if you or someone in your family has one of the following diseases, you may increase your chances of developing Hashimoto's disease. Type 1 diabetes, rheumatoid arthritis, Addison's disease, Graves' disease, vitiligo, Sjogren's syndrome, Hashimoto's disease symptoms. In general, there are no symptoms of the disease, but the symptoms that may appear on the patient are symptoms caused by damage to the thyroid gland, and these are the most important. Constant tiredness and fatigue, an unusual feeling of cold, thinning in the hair, memory problems, dryness of the skin, depression, slow heartbeat, increase in weight. Factors that increase the risk of Hashimoto's disease. Women are generally more likely than men to get this disease, especially women who have been pregnant at some point in their lives. Excessive intake of iodine supplements. Exposure to radiation. Low levels of vitamin B12. Hashimoto's disease diagnosis. To reach the diagnosis, the patient is subjected to a variety of tests, which include 1. Thyroid hormone tests. 2. Regular blood test. 3. Cholesterol check. 4. Antibody assay. Hashimoto's disease treatment. There is no cure for Hashimoto's disease, but replacing hormones with medications can regulate hormone levels and restore normal metabolism. The pills are available in several different strengths. The exact dose your doctor prescribes depends on the number of factors, including the age, weight, the severity of hypothyroidism. Once treatment begins, your doctor will order a lab test called a thyroid stimulating hormone, TSH test, to monitor thyroid function and help ensure you get the correct dose. Because thyroid hormones act very slowly in the body, it may take a few months for symptoms to disappear and the goiter to shrink. However, a large goiter that does not improve may make it necessary to remove the thyroid gland. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.